<laughs> I think this might be the biggest vehicle on the car jump arena ever. 200! Yes! Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome to another episode of Beam NG Quickies. Today, we are going to be checking out quite possibly the biggest and most luxurious RV ever made in Beam NG Drive. It goes by the name of the Melmoth Landliner and uh, it's inspired by early 20th century um, ocean liner. So think Titanic but on the road. And just to give you guys a scale of how big this thing is, <laughs> this is all pure luxury. And we even have, uh, <laughs> we even have the chimneys with fire coming out the top. It is a thing of beauty. I don't know if we're going to fit through this, uh, here toll booth. Uh, I may, I may have screwed up here guys, but for now, let's take a tour of the landliner so i believe if i push uh what, what button is it yeah okay it's it's a t button there we go it opens up to us so let's actually get into first person here and take a step inside and see what there is to see mtv cribs coming at you anyway welcome aboard the melmoth landliner we have our first person golden snowman here absolutely beautiful oh my goodness gracious this is amazing we have a little bar here you love it you absolutely love it some dining chairs of course you need those for sure can we get some drinks <laughs> i don't know i feel like there should be drinks back here for sure definitely getting that art deco feel uh, it looks like we have a bedroom back here. There we go with a beautiful painting of uh, what looks to be East Coast USA. Am I, uh, am I correct in saying that? I think so. Uh, I have a little spot to work and I imagine there's probably a bathroom. That's actually, let's take a look here. Yeah, there is a bathroom. There we go. So you can do your business in peace on the road. Okay, so that's not all there is to see here. Uh, if we go up here, you'll see some stairs now how do we actually get those to lower well i believe hold on let's see i believe if we push i'm gonna pause it so we can actually see this if we push g and then let's go back into first person here and spawn like right here there we go and then if i do this will it no come on man i want to see it come down in first person hold on a second all right you know what we'll do it this way here we go so if we push is it g yes g G? No, it's not G. That's uh oh, that's the trailer. Uh, you know, it doesn't matter. It's O. It's O. <laughs> okay, it took us a second, but we got it. Alrighty, so now we can take a step up the stairs. Another big lounge chair. Not sure how legal this would be while you're driving down the road, but you know it's an option. So yeah, we have a nice uh deck up here. Really, a lot going on with this thing. Not gonna lie, it's pretty insane how luxurious this thing is man it's more it's literally just a semi trailer but uh renovated to be uh, a luxurious living space quite literally a titanic on the road anyway i know you guys want to see me crash this uh so that's exactly what we're gonna do now so let's get the gangway back up and let's put the uh the stairs back up as well beautiful man beautiful and uh, let's see <laughs> if we can make it through this. I really don't think uh, I don't think we can. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to take a little bit of a shortcut here. Hopefully we don't lose any of the deck chairs. I, I, I don't know if they're glued on or not. But yeah, let's just take a nice little stroll here. Get up to a good healthy speed and then slam it into the wall and see what happens because I, I know you guys want to see if it's going to accordion or explode. We're going to figure that out right now. Yeah, this is a heavy SOB. You can tell we are getting up to speed, but this is one of the faster T series. And even this is, is struggling quite a bit. We got some fire coming out the top of this thing. It looks pretty awesome. 
Not gonna lie. We haven't lost the deck chair yet, so maybe it is screwed down. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. I would hope it is, though. Definitely. Oh, that was close. It's tall, too, man. Very, very tall. All right, here we go. Let's crash it right into the pole here. Let's slow down. Just there we go, because I want to see every little crunch. Oh, 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 there goes the chair. Hey, you know what? Honestly, honestly, this held up pretty freaking good. I will say that held up pretty freaking good. Wow. I, there's a dent for sure. But besides that, really not much happening. So what happens if we shoot a cannonball at it? Maybe that'll uh, rip a hole in it. Maybe we can... <laughs> Maybe we can run into an iceberg too soon. I don't know. Maybe. Anywho, uh, let's let's shoot this cannonball right at the side here. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that did something. That put a dent or two. Oh wow! Yeah, a, a sizable dent actually. What's uh? Let's do it one more time. Slow mo this time. Oh! <laughs> I wonder if we could just like straight up rip a hole in this thing. Like, boom! And once more! Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna rip it in half, but we could definitely damage it. Maybe we just got really lucky on that first crash. Uh, I don't really know. Where's this plant? I never saw a plant. Anyway, there it is. Maybe it was on the bottom or something. Anyway, I know you guys want to see it, so let's take this thing to the car jump arena. If we can even fit it on there and uh, see how far it'll fly. <laughs> Look at all these tables flying everywhere, man. Oh, how much does this thing cost, I wonder? Probably a couple mil. All righty. So, yes, it does fit. But uh, it's hard to get this entire thing in frame. You got to zoom out quite a bit. But let's set this down the car jump arena. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're stuck. We're stuck. <laughs> give it enough speed. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Let's not do that. Let's not get stuck. Oh, no. It's too big. Come on, baby. Get those tires on the ground. No. Oh, this is going to suck. I need more speed. Go, baby. Go, baby. Go, 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 go. Go. Come on. There we go. There we go. Shoosh. Okay. We got it now, baby. We got it. 100 miles an hour. We are cruising. Can we get this thing drifted? Probably not. But <laughs> I think this might be the biggest vehicle on the car jump arena ever. 200. Yes. Can we get it in the water? It is supposed to be a, a yacht, a ship, a steamer. Oh. <laughs> and we banana it. Oh, it folded, man. It folded. How's this holding up the bed? It has it has cloth physics for the curtains, man. <laughs> wow. Wow. A work of art. A work of art. The Melmoth Landliner. I'll link to this down below if you want to try it out for yourself. Definitely worth the download. It's a lot of fun to mess around with. A lot of cool details as well. You love to see it, man. Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode of BMG Quickies. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did... Make sure to hit that like button down below and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya.